Hi everyone, my name is Mia Goriano. I'm a fourth year here at RIT studying photographic sciences, and for my capstone project, I created the Photographic Sciences Bulletin magazine. The Photographic Sciences Bulletin is essentially a collective of what the Photographic Sciences program is about, more specifically, the people in it. Started in 1987, the Bulletin was designed with the same goal, a culmination of life and the ongoings of the Photo Sciences program. It actually used to be printed in black and white, then was able to be made in color before quickly switching to an online platform. Unfortunately, the bulletin fizzled out with time and the last copy was released in 2016 and the class accompanying it is no longer available. Sad as it is that the bulletin is no longer, I'm glad I've had the opportunity to turn it into my capstone project and hopefully revive its rich history in our program. As you can imagine, this was a very large project. It took lots of effort on my part, but also a strong willingness and desire to participate from our community. I had lots of meetings and interviews with our professors, students, and alumni to ensure I had all the correct information for spotlights and the educational articles. Furthermore, I was able to meet with so many new people and make meaningful connections, which is the heart of my project. I was initially worried about this, but when I received so much feedback and participation from our alumni, I got my hopes up and actually had to add more spotlights to accommodate those who wanted in on the project. I'm a very visual person, as you can tell by my desire to take on a project of this scale. I honestly think I may have gone through a whole composition notebook of just writing down ideas, drafts of double page spreads, and just in general doodling while I brainstorm more content for the bulletin. A lot of the ideas I had either just came to me or from spending hours scrolling through issue.com or other magazine platforms gathering information for layouts from other magazines. My favorite magazines to look at included alumni magazines for other colleges. They were always so put together and it really inspired me to stick to a theme within the magazine. I then took these ideas and translated them into InDesign, which was not as easy as it sounds. Thankfully, I'm very familiar with the program as I've taken some courses revolving around using the application. Still, I find myself struggling sometimes converting what was just a quick sketch on paper into something beautiful and eye-catching that people will want to read. Because of this, I reached out to classmates and people outside the photo sciences circle to see if they really liked it and would want to flip through something like this. I can't even begin to thank all of those who helped bring this project together. From the current seniors, to our professors, to all the alumni who helped and offered me so much guidance, both for the magazine and for life in general. I'd especially like to thank Dan Hughes for advising me on this project, and Christy Sisson for facilitating the capstone class. It would not be possible without them. There's a quote that goes, individually, we are one drop, but together we are an ocean, and that's exactly what I think of for this project. It required the whole community to make it happen. Overall, I'm really proud I did this. I mean, I always thought it was possible, but I figured I would have to cut corners. Instead, it felt like I added corners, if that's the correct saying. I hope this project inspires you to connect with others or even make your own bulletin someday. I'm really glad I had the opportunity to get to know everybody in our program, and I hope that it continues to thrive the way it is. Thank you.